Hi, welcome to Math Test Prep, where today we are going to answer a standardized math test question where we need to estimate the side length of a square. Our question states, a rug in the shape of a square has an area of 33 square feet. Which of the following estimates is closest to the length of each side of the rug? So noting that it says estimate, we aren't going to probably be allowed a calculator for this question when we're asked this on a test day and we are estimating the length of each side of the rug. So my test stra taking strategy right now is knowing that I have to find the area of a square, I'm gonna give myself a visual representation. So I have a square where all four sides are equal. It is 33. So we know that the area of a square is equal to S squared or side times side. Even length times width is side times side. So we know that the area can be replaced with the value 33 because we've been given that in the question. So now to solve this equation, we need to find the square root of each side. The square root of s squared is easy, that's s, but we don't have a calculator. So to estimate the square root of 33, I'm going to make a number line. My number line shows me that the value of the square root of 33 is between the whole numbers 5 and 6 because the square root of 25 is 5 and the square root of 36 is 6. So the square root of 33 lies somewhere in this space. So it's going to be 5 and something. So I notice that I have two choices, 5 and a quarter or 5 and 3 quarters. So now I need to identify if the square root of 33 is closer to tw the square root of 25 or closer to the square root of 36. So it's only three away from the square root of 36, but it is eight away from here. So it's closer to six than it is to five, and it's more than halfway between. Therefore, my answer choice would be B.